Hi dear viewers, this is Arash Kamali with another session of the website programming course on the Python programming language and the Django framework. Again, as always, a very warm and heartfelt welcome from me. If you remember, in the previous session, we worked on the show and made the keywords and the descriptions on our pages available. And now we are going to point out some more stuff on so because as we said, so has a special course with its own technicalities, and we are going to do it in a basic form. But in a professional format, it needs its own a special course, of course, as you might remember me reminding you. One of the other things that we can do to increase our show is to use the H1 tag on our page and uh, and have a title or description in this tag. H1 tags are important. We can use these tags or the images that we use on our site uh, for uh, instance to give you a correct example we can go to the first page the news that we have and uh, they're being shown on the first page in the images okay uh, let's see what we got over here perhaps not much but uh, they are all useful yeah we are using it in the style form uh, if we use it it uh, use it in the image tag in a normal fashion we could give it an alt feature so that in case of not loading that alt was going to show a text a text that is inside a tag uh, when our site showing the images if we use suitable alts that match our images and this is also going to help us okay so you need to check this into account so that we have a range image alt feature uh, there are some size uh, within this field that can be really helpful to you and analyze your site and can tell you using which words can improve your site those sites decide the, what the best words can be at any time so that we can do it to go to the google site and introduce it to the google search engine what google does is to give us a file or a code so that we can set it on our host or upload it or set it on the first page it is similar to the authentication process uh, to make sure that this is your site and you introduce your site to the google search engine and it tells you which words are better to use which words are missing and such information so you can you these are the things that you can use for the improvement of the so of your site if you search for the so of the site you will have lots of articles and other messages that are available on google and the websites that you find there uh, it is open uh, like open graph tag or we can use the open graph tag uh, after these tags we can introduce new tag we say for example meta meta and we name it okay tag meta name equals okay A colon open graph short for open graph and the title okay here the title equals site dot name all right and then we have a property property equals again colon og again colon and again the side title okay let's see how it goes getting us through okay and after that we can have a content and this content again an explanation or we can use the title so again we go over here we use the so short explanation okay now we refresh the first page let's see and check the page source you see we have added an open graph tag of course we have forgotten 
to close this tag we forgot to close it pay attention to close the tags which is very to closing the tags which is very important this is going to be done and now we added another tag if you search the internet you will find a lot of messages that can help you with the so of your side and it's not something to be forgotten or neglect neglected pay that pay enough attention